You know, you always hear about who you know can get you where you want to go, but I feel that who knows you, that's what's important. My name is Leonard Acuna, and I graduated 2010 with two degrees in kinesiology and film production. I work at a post-production house over in Hollywood called Chainsaw. I'm what they call an assistant editor. Spending my time at CSUN, it showed what I really wanted to do. I started out as a computer science major. My grades reflected that I wasn't really good at it. So I started following my passion because I was into martial arts and all that. And I went to the kinesiology um, department. I saw they had martial arts classes. I'm like, okay, I'll try this major. I started learning about biomechanics, physiology, and I was like, oh, this is so cool. When I was almost done with kinesiology, I walked into Manzanita. That was another passion of mine was making videos. So I'm like, ah, I don't want to leave this campus and regret not doing it. So I took some extra time, added two more years to pursue film. Being at CSUN, I was actually able to utilize both majors because I was helping Dr. Loy over at Kinesiology making videos promoting kinesiology. Now we've gained an audience in the White House because we entered a video contest promoted by Michelle Obama and our video, uh, 100 Citizens, won the popular vote. 100 Citizens is about developing programs in every Cal State University for kinesiology students to go out there and help people who can't afford to go to gyms and be healthy or who are just ignorant about exercise. A lot of people out there don't want to work out because they think that they have to do bench presses all the time and they don't know what to do with that machine or that machine and what that guy is doing looks painful. So a lot of people are turned off. If you think about it, we have a lot of gyms out there, more than ever, yet our obesity stats, uh, it's worse than ever. And the great thing about 100 Citizens is that it involves kinesiology students who need experience working with people. And what I found out after graduating, a lot of people out there look for people who have experience. But if you've never had a job, how are you gonna get experience? And how are you going to get hired if you don't have experience? So it's kind of like a symbiotic relationship between getting experience and helping people at the same time. Networking is important because that's how I got my foot in the door. Anytime you know someone said, "Hey, you know, I work for NBC," I was like, "Hey, I just graduated from CSUN, degree in film, and I was able to show my work because of what I did at CSUN. I have a reel." And I knew somebody who worked at Chainsaw, and you know they slipped my resume in. I got an interview, and here I am. You know, create your network. Don't start after college creating that network. You're in school. You're still in the in the protection of being a college student. That's the best time to take risks. Put yourself out there. You know, you're coming from a great university, and people respect CSUN. You can get a lot of internships because of that. So that way, you're building network and you're gaining experience, which what people really look for in the real world. 